We've arrived at that point, folks. Kind of like How I Met Your Mother, I'm out of ideas on how to begin this show, so I'm doing the entire thing completely in song. <clears throat> I'm totally kidding. Though I do have some cool videos for you guys. Welcome back to The Loop, and I'm Carter Naki. In case you didn't notice a few weeks ago, I'm a pretty big fan of Emma Stone. She's from Arizona, she's really pretty, and she's damn talented. She's also not without her musical preferences, though I'm not exactly on board with those. Here's the story from A to Z. You wanna get with me? You better listen carefully. We got M in your face who likes it. Mm -hmm. We got G with MC who likes it on Easy B. Doesn't come for free. She's a real age. But never fear, Miss Stone has redeemed herself. She was on the Tonight Show with Jimmy Fallon and he challenged her to a lip syncing contest. Fallon normally rocks the show. He started strong. Taking all the lips straight, never chase that. Never stop like we bring an 88 back. What? Bring the hook scene where the bass at. Champagne spilling, you should taste that. I'm so fancy. But then came Emma, and holy crap, did she bring it. Her first song was good. Bitch, can't rely. Suck it in, suck it in, suck it in. If you're into it, make it just bring more to us to win. And then begin to see what you do. Her second song, just watch. Boom! Game over, Fallon. What's next? Ten months past, we got this down. Good thing, because we're, we're telling you, we're telling you, we. we are having, having, having another baby. Dear God, why? Oh, the world did not need this. As a guy in his mid, <clears throat> fine, late 20s, I have a lot of friends having kids. I get the little postcard in the mail or see the news on Facebook, say, that's nice, and move on with my day. But Nate and Erica Eaton had to take it one million steps further. We are having, having, having Another baby, your shock, so are your friends, so are our friends, so are we. Can I ask just one favor? If you're going to put your own twist on a song, can you at least make it good? Everybody's cooking for the weekend. Everybody wears a new chef's hand. Much better. Do you see how easy that is? What's next? First I was afraid. I was petrified. They flushed my head several times, exposing my behind. But then I spent so many nights working on my grand revenge. I'll be your boss. I'm gonna make you be my slave. Another good example of covering a song. This is a bullying ad produced by VH1, but it still counts. It also has a solid message. Bully kids now, work for them later. As a former nerdy kid, I can agree with um, a lot of these sentiments. My power, I will abuse. I'll be the CEO, you'll be the one who shines my shoes. I'm gonna call you night and day, and on weekends I'll send texts, as you for all kinds of things, making sure you'll never rest. And behind a tiny desk, you'll be saying your regret. You'll be my pet, you'll be my pet. But as a professional on Facebook, not so much. There is no justice in this world when the same kid who threw you in a trash can is traveling to Bora Bora on his private jet with his former model girlfriend. But he doesn't have his own show. Just all that other really awesome stuff. And on that bitter note, let's call it a show. As always, all these stories and more are available for your perusal on the Lasso blog on KTR.com. Sharing the loop would be great. There are buttons there and buttons there to make it very easy for you. Go on, click away. And now that you've shared, let's close it out on a high note. Do you want to see how a dad reacted when he found out he was going to be a grandpa? Actually, no. <laughs> All right. <laughs> really? Yep. Yeah.